Hey guys, I'm going to do a review on um, Rough Country 4.5 basic lift kit. So um, this is the basic option you can get on the 4.5 lift. Um, let's go. So totally there are three boxes. They come with the numbering on it. So you can see that in this uh, manual, whatever they had given here, you can see the box numberings. In the last page so it contains the list of the items and which is where in which box so let me show you that so I already marked all the parts are there except this four transfer case spaces was being duplicated uh, it was somewhere else also so other than that everything is being uh, uh, there in the list okay let's go ahead and open one by one so these are labels okay the first box is a bigger one this has u-bolts two sets of u-bolts which is totally eight u-bolts uh, this is the smaller size and this is little beefier okay and uh, it has um, sway bar drop bracket Sorry, the sway bar itself, the French sway bar, and uh, this is the sway bar uh, drop bracket. Uh, some few labels inside this shackles. So two shackles. The good thing about this 4.5 basic kit comes with the shackles. I never seen this in even in the X series. So it purely depends upon you. Once I got this, I thought if I would have taken the X series, it would be way nicer because they have a uh, very nice uh, uh, sway bar drop brackets and a sway bar uh, itself. This thing is keep on coming. Okay. Yeah. So in the top, you see the shackles, uh, eight U bolts. Uh, four different size um, and the other four is a different size um, and the bracket so under this you have the rear suspensions uh, rear shocks and the French shocks the shocks bushings are not included in this but it is there inside this box and the lower control arm two lower control arm okay and this is what I wanted to actually go in depth because I never seen this explained detailed in the just they say it hardware so let me go through this so eight bolts are there for your uh, uh, for the U clamp This is uh, for one side of your French shocks bushings. So second one for the front uh, shocks bushings. And yeah, this is what one I wanted to show you guys. So these are the shackle bolt uh, bolts. So I believe this is two different size. Um, the smaller one is for the suspension. Uh, for the top itself uh, top of the shackles and the smaller one um, yeah the smaller one is for the top of the shackles and the bigger one is uh, uh, bottom of the shackles and the shackle bushings and uh, all nets and wasers are included inside this so if you wonder just they ship the shack uh, shackles alone or do they ship the bowls for the suspension yes they do they ship the bowls for the uh, the leaf spring um, so these bowls uh, especially I couldn't find the size for this one even in the website if you see they don't say size but when I gone through this one it says it has okay where is the size okay the size is over there in this 
okay here is it okay it is 14 mm into 10, 110 mm okay the other size is uh, 9 by 16 inch into 4 inch bolts so I don't know which goes where but uh, there are uh, two two bolts of each which is for your shackles upside and the shackles bottom so there is no bolts for the print of your leaf spring uh, probably you can reuse the factory hardware I believe the factory bolts are even stronger uh, those are black hardened bolts but the problem is always it gets stuck with this bushing so I have to cut my bolts luckily I got uh, some bolts from this uh, rough country 4.5 lift kit but I did order two bolts from quarterdeck.com I will explain that later so these are transfer case drops and if you wonder yes they give the bolts for the transfer case drop yeah so these are for I believe these are for your um, yeah these are for your uh, sway bar drop brackets say sway bar uh, bushings and the, these are for your uh, uh, brake lining extender clamp um, if you are going with the uh, extended brake lines you don't need to use this or you can use this it's just the drop bracket if you are using the factory brake lines uh, I definitely would recommend to use uh, extended brake line because 4.5 I believe there will be more travel it's better to use the uh, extended brake lines let's go to the box number two yeah so the box number two is very simple there are two leaf springs added leaf springs and it comes with the leaf spring hardware which is the center bolt and four clamp and clip for the leaf spring so that's all in the box two and box three these were not included in uh, rough country this i bought it separately i will show you what is that and box three came only with two um, coil springs so these were not there these are all my extra items okay so the box three came with two four point five coil springs heavy looks nice and good quality okay so that's all guys if you have any doubts please comment I will reply immediately as soon as possible so you have all the hardware and uh, the main thing I wanted to say is yes the bolts and nets are included for the shackles just for the rear shackles bottom and the top not for the front leaf spring and the bolts are included for the sway bar as well as and you get eight different eight uh, eight u bolts um, so i think this one goes with the xj uh, the smaller one is for a different kind of axle i believe i don't know which one is that so that's all guys uh, thank you for watching the video and if you have any doubts please comment i will replay it immediately and if you like and if you feel this is useful hit subscribe and give me a like thank you so these are the brake lines so these are the rear brake lines um, there are two in this uh, sorry these are the front brake lines there are two in this um, I got this for um, $20 yeah I got this for $20 in Amazon this is not a rough country this is from a different brand it says it will go with a 4 to 6 inches lift so was cheaper than the rough country so I bought that and it's a steel brake lines and this is for the rear 
the, the rear single piece itself cost like twenty dollars so um, I believe this one cost me thirty and this one cost me twenty so altogether it came fifty dollars so the front and the rear brake lines extended brake lines and this is what I was talking about I need to cut my uh, leaf spring bolt on the rear um, yeah the reason is it got stuck with the bushing so I ordered this uh, in quarterTech.com um, still the size are not being mentioned sorry I couldn't give you the information about that but these are eight dollars you can order it from quarterTech.com 